Today we're breaking down exactly how whey protein isolate is made, step by step, and why it's considered superior for digestion, purity, and results. The world of nutritional supplements can often feel like a complicated and overwhelming maze, filled with technical jargon and competing claims that leave even the most dedicated fitness enthusiast feeling confused. Among the vast array of products available, whey protein stands out as a cornerstone, athletes, bodybuilders, anyone looking to enhance their dietary protein intake. Yet, even within this single category, choices must be made. You have likely seen terms like concentrate, isolate, hydrolysate, each promising superior results. This essay is designed to cut through that noise and offer a clear, straightforward explanation of one of the most popular and refined forms of whey, whey protein isolate. We will demystify the entire process from start to finish. This guide will serve as your step-by-step -step roadmap to understanding exactly what you are putting into your body. Before we can delve into the intricate processes that create different types of whey protein powders, it is essential to start with the absolute basics. What is whey? The origin of whey is surprisingly simple, rooted in the art of making cheese. Milk, primarily from cows, is composed of two main types of protein, casein, whey. Casein makes up approximately 80% of the protein in milk, while whey accounts for the remaining 20%. When cheesemakers add a coagulant like rennet, or an acid to milk, it causes the milk to separate into two distinct parts. This process is known as curdling. The solid, lumpy part that forms during this separation is the casein, the curds. The curds are pressed, the curds are aged, and transformed into the various types of cheese we all know and love. The liquid component that is left behind is the whey, for centuries, this watery, translucent liquid was often considered a waste product and was either discarded or used as animal feed. It was only in more recent history that food scientists began to recognize the incredible nutritional value. This liquid whey is not just water. It contains a potent combination of high-quality proteins, lactose, milk sugar, some fats, vitamins, and essential minerals. The protein found within this liquid whey is what makes it so special. It is classified as a complete protein. To truly appreciate what makes whey isolate a premium product, it helps to understand whey protein concentrate. Whey concentrate is the most common and foundational form of whey powder. Production involves basic filtration, typically ultrafiltration, which removes water, lactose, and fat. Liquid whey is passed through a semi-permeable membrane. The filter lets water, minerals, smaller lactose molecules and smaller fat molecules pass through, while retaining larger protein molecules. The result is a liquid with much higher protein concentration than raw whey. That liquid is spray-dried, sprayed into a hot air chamber. The water evaporates almost instantly, leaving a fine powder. That powder is whey protein concentrate. Protein content varies widely, typically 35% to 80% protein by weight, with most quality supplements around 70-80%. The remaining 20-30% to are carbohydrates in the form of lactose and fats. Because it is less processed, concentrate retains more bioactive compounds and growth factors found in milk, such as lactoferrin and immunoglobulins, which can support the immune system. Many users find its higher fat and lactose give a creamier texture and a milk-like taste. For many, concentrate is a cost-effective, high-quality protein. It supports muscle growth and recovery, but higher lactose levels can be a problem for the lactose intolerant or sensitive, potentially causing bloating, gas, or stomach cramps. Extra carbs and fats may not suit very strict low-carb or low-fat diets, such as competitive bodybuilders during cutting. Section 4. The Refinement Process – How Whey Isolate is Made The creation of whey protein isolate is a story of advanced purification. It starts with whey concentrate, then goes through rigorous filtration steps to remove non-protein components. The goal – isolate protein, reach 90% or higher protein content, and drastically reduce lactose and fat to near zero. This meticulous process defines the product's premium status. The most common method uses advanced membrane filtration designed to be gentle on delicate proteins. First, microfiltration then. 
cross-flow microfiltration. Whey is pumped across ceramic membranes perforated with microscopic pores. Pores allow water, lactose, fats, and other very small solutes through. Larger protein molecules are retained. Cross-flow keeps the membrane from clogging by pumping parallel to the surface, ensuring continuous, efficient separation. Process runs at low temperatures to preserve undenatured proteins and bioactive subfractions. Some manufacturers use ion exchange chromatography. It separates proteins by electrical charge. Whey passes through a charged resin column. Proteins bind to the resin while uncharged lactose and fat are washed away. Proteins are eluded by changing the pH. This can give very high protein concentrations, but chemical and pH steps can risk denaturing some subfractions. After filtration, you still have a high protein liquid. Final step, spray drying into powder. The liquid is atomized into a fine mist inside a heated chamber. Hot air evaporates the water, instantly dry protein particles fall and are collected. Result, whey protein isolate powder with 90 to 97% protein and only trace lactose and fat. When you place whey isolate and whey concentrate side by side, the differences born from their distinct manufacturing processes become clear benefits for specific users. The most significant and often cited advantage of whey isolate is its superior purity, which translates into several tangible perks for the consumer. Understanding these benefits is key to deciding whether the typically higher price point of isolate is a worthwhile investment for your health and fitness journey. These advantages go beyond just a number on a nutrition label. Digestion, dietary adherence, and even the speed of muscle recovery. The primary benefits of choosing whey isolate can be summarized as follows. Higher protein percentage, with 90% or more protein by weight. This means more muscle building amino acids per 30 gram serving. This efficiency is valued by those maximizing protein without extra volume or calories. Extremely low lactose content. The advanced filtration processes used to create isolate remove most lactose. That makes isolate ideal for people with lactose intolerance or sensitivity. Lower in fat, lower in carbohydrates, resulting in a product that is virtually carb-free. This cleaner macronutrient profile helps precise macro tracking for calorie-controlled diets. Faster absorption rate, because isolate is so pure, it's often absorbed more rapidly than concentrate. That rapid delivery of amino acids can kickstart post-workout muscle repair. Many users also report a better sensory experience. Thinner consistency, cleaner, less milky taste, and easier mixing into water. The neutral profile of unflavored isolate makes it versatile for recipes. This combination of high purity, digestive ease, and rapid absorption is what positions whey isolate as a superior choice for specific dietary needs and performance goals. It's important to acknowledge the trade-off. The intensive processing removes some beneficial bioactive compounds, like certain immunoglobulins retained in whey concentrate. Section 6. Who is whey isolate for? Identifying the ideal user. With a clear understanding of what whey isolate is and the benefits it offers, the next logical question is, who should actually be using it? While anyone can benefit from a high-quality protein source, whey isolate is not a one-size-fits-all solution. Its specific characteristics make it an ideal choice for certain groups. For these individuals, the extra cost is easily justified by enhanced performance, improved digestive comfort, greater dietary precision. The most obvious candidates for whey isolate are individuals with lactose intolerance or sensitivity. For this group, consuming a standard whey concentrate can trigger a cascade of unpleasant digestive symptoms, rendering the protein supplement virtually unusable. Because whey isolate has had nearly all of its lactose filtered out, it offers a way for these individuals to reap the muscle building and recovery benefits of whey protein without gastrointestinal distress. For them, isolate is not just a better option. It is often the only viable whey-based option available. Another key group consists of competitive athletes and serious bodybuilders, particularly during a cutting or fat loss phase. 
The near zero fat and carbohydrate content of whey isolate allows for unparalleled macronutrient precision. It enables them to hit their high protein targets to preserve lean muscle mass while simultaneously keeping their total calorie, carb, and fat intake strictly controlled. The faster absorption rate is also a theoretical advantage for these athletes, who seek to optimize the post-workout recovery window and maximize muscle protein synthesis as efficiently as possible. Beyond these two primary groups, whey isolate is also an excellent choice for anyone pursuing aggressive weight loss goals or following a very low carbohydrate diet, such as a ketogenic diet. Finally, there are those who simply prefer a cleaner product. They value smooth mixability, clean taste, and the peace of mind that comes with a highly refined supplement. Conversely, for the average gym goer simply looking to increase daily protein intake, a high quality whey concentrate is often perfectly sufficient and more economical. If your body tolerates lactose well and you are not counting every last gram of fat or carbohydrate, the robust protein profile of a good concentrate will support your muscle building goals effectively. Whey Isolate goes through multiple filtration steps that remove lactose, fat, and impurities, leaving you with a high-purity, fast-digesting protein that's ideal for performance, digestion, and recovery. Subscribe for more science-based breakdowns of supplements, training, and nutrition.